Let's see how it works. Yeah. Wow. Did you see that? Hi, SG Uncle is an experimental project demonstrating lifelong learning in Singapore. Thanks for watching. Hi everybody. Wow, the school holidays have come to an end. Hope everyone had a good time already. Um, this is the M2 MacBook Air. If you have not watched the first video, you can have a look. I mentioned that I want to talk about some of the very budget accessories that we can get. So today we'll be looking at them. Uh, actually, I ordered them during 99, during 99 on Shopee sales, and they have already arrived for a few days. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to film this because um, number one, I was having my facilitation exam, my certification exam, as well as um, my neighbors are doing renovation. I don't know if you can hear them. I've already closed the door and turned on the aircon, but I can still hear some of the sound. Um, I may try to edit the sound um, subsequently uh, during the um, processing, but uh, if you do hear them, uh, please forgive me. Okay. So for the first and foremost, right, um, I really enjoyed the MacBook Air here this time. The battery life is very good, but I wasn't able to bring this out of the house. Bummer, right? Because it doesn't have a cover. So now the cover has already arrived. I've earlier on opened it up. Now let me fetch it. Ta-da. Okay, it looks like this. Um, one thing that I didn't really quite like it was that um, this. The, the legs are in, in white, you know, as opposed to the midnight color, which is black. It has a black feet, um, but um, here we only have the white one. So it comes in two pieces, the bottom shell, and the other one is the top shell. The bottom shell has a ventilation hole. Actually, it's um, really not necessary, but I guess it still helps um, uh, for cases whereby you have uh, those laptop stand with fan uh, in it. So these slots here, uh, if you're doing something more intensive on the MacBook Air, you can consider to place the fan underneath here and all these slots will allow the heat to dissipate faster. Okay, so let's put this away first. Let's look at the, the bottom cover. And again, the, the Midnight Mac. This is a fingerprint magnet. Okay, it's true. Okay, it's, it's quite bad. So um, uh, I have to... I have to highlight here that I've not decided whether I want to keep this color or I'm or to go back to the starlight color. Okay, so the bottom cover slips on like this. Okay. Um, you have to look at where the pots are. Okay, so the pots are here. Gently put it in. Click on. You will hear several clipping sounds, right? Okay. Aha, there you have it. Okay, wow. I think it looks good. It snugs, you know, very tight. The, the connection here, look at the this part. There's always a clip on and it allows the pots to open. There was another one that was under review and several of the reviews said that the bottom shell actually came off very easily. So I didn't take that one after reading the comment. So I go for this, uh, which was end up being cheaper on Nina itself. Um, if anyone wants the link, I can also put it here. Okay, so now you have the top piece. So the top piece uh, also comes with these clips, okay? The clips have to follow the clips. So if you see a clip here, uh, I'll put it near to the camera so you can see. There is a slight clip here. There's an elevation, right? Okay, so that's where you clip on. So here, you see the clip here, right? Yep. So it should be facing the, the side that has the clip on. Okay. First, you... Put it to the back, the back first. Wow, this is so reflective. <laughs> Maybe a hard time. Okay, with the cover, oh, it clips on already. See, uh, that, that part also, and this part clips on. Okay, you make sure it has to be snug. Okay, otherwise you'll lose a grip of it. Okay, wow. It looks a bit hefty now. It looks a bit, uh, it's not as thin. But, but I think that it protects the device. Okay, and now for the second item, a USB hub. Okay, I bought a particular brand from um, Shopee, but it wasn't working. Uh, I think it was, it, it was meant for Windows platform, but yet they sold it 
uh, saying that it could work for MacBook. In the end, um, it just didn't work for my case. Just in case you're wondering where are all my addresses, I normally cut them. Call it paranoia. <laughs> okay, now this is the USB hub for the basis. Okay, uh, I've used uh, several items from this particular company, basis. Uh, I'm not being paid by basis, but I'm, I bought this. So I recommend this particular brand. Has been pretty reliable. Some of the items that I bought for them. Not all items. Um, I, I can't say for all. Uh, but the review for this is very good. As opposed to the earlier one that was um, faulty and uh, wasn't able to work for the Macintosh platform. Uh, this is uh, reviewed online by other reviewers that is, is working. So it came from China. In a few days it came. And uh, I don't know if you can see clearly. One of it, the basis uh, tip can connect to the laptop or my MacBook, a tablet or even a handphone. And here on the other end, right, which I'll show you later on, is the hub itself. Okay, so 6-in-1 comes with additional things. Number one, it comes with the PD charger. That means that you can plug in. Once one of the ports is being plugged into the MacBook, right, you can basically charge with this one. Right, you can put in your SD or micro SD cards. Then the most important thing is that I need um, the HDMI port to connect to my monitor, my Prism Plus monitor. And as for the rest, the USB 3, uh, three USB 3.0 ports. So this is actually very good. So as opposed to uh, uh, something different from the other brands is this particular button here. For example, just for the sake of presentation and you don't want your um, learners to see the screen, all you have to do is press this particular button. Then you can press uh, basically work on your own computer notebook screen uh, without having letting them see this part, uh, what's on the screen. That means what you're amending. Okay, so I'm going to open this up. Okay, it seems to be a tab here that I can just pull directly. Um, this arrived just last evening, so I've not personally seen it. I haven't seen one in, in real life as well. Um, uh, okay, let me tell you the price. I got it uh, during 9.9 sale as well. It was, it, it was really uh, competitive. I will not use the word cheap, but um, for me, it serves my purpose. Um, yeah, I have another one that just arrived as well uh, on two separate days, but uh, it was bought during the same time. And that was what I, my buddy wanted. So my buddy was coming back from Thailand. So because um, he could not, uh, he was, it was close to midnight, after midnight that he came back. So he asked me to look for the flash sale. So Basis was having a flash uh, sale during that time. So I got this for about, um, um, if including all the uh, Shopee coins that I get back, I think this one costs about $16. Uh, I was at Challenger uh, two days ago and, and, I, and I saw this, um, and it's not even the 6-in-1, it was a 4-in-1 and it was already priced at con uh, about $40. Um, let's put this away. Oh, so basically there's nothing inside. Wow. <laughs> okay, as usual, they give a sticker. I don't know for who. Maybe give to my daughter. I don't know whether she wants or not. But looks like something that you paste on your on your hub. Okay, this is um, it's, it's made of... It's made of plastic. Okay, but plastically good. Yeah, I would say that it looks good. Oh, I really like this one. Oh, so guess what? Okay, so when you carry along, right? There's a little re a recess here. Can you see the recess? Uh, maybe let me on my lights. I think it's getting dark again. Seems like it's gonna... I'm depending on um, sunlight. Okay, well, I hope it's better already with the lights turned on. So this particular recess that you see here, what it does is that you basically, when you carry... Put it in. Wow. <laughs> I don't know if you drop it like this, but I guess it's just for the ease of carrying. I don't know if you can hang it on your back because it's really very light. Okay, it's really very light. And it matches my mag my midnight color, uh, which I <laughs> may not keep as well. <laughs> oh, it's okay. I, I only uh, This will mostly be at home. I think it will be at home. Because if I'm at a shop, coffee shop or elsewhere, I do not need this. But because of the lack of HDMI port in the MacBook Air, this is very important. Do you see the HDMI port that I was referring to? The micro SD card. If you still use micro SD, 
uh, I, I do have it for my Android tablet. Um, then the SD card, or oh, this is particularly important for, for those that are in professional photography, right? Because a lot of the, the super high speed um, SD cards, you can slot it here. Yeah, and this is the PD charging port that, that I was referring to earlier. And this is the button that you press and the screen goes off. Like the, the HDMI screen goes off. So no one gets to see what you're working on your notebook. Then there are two more uh, USB 3.0 ports. Okay, so this is um, so this is about it. I may not, I do not think that my session will include uh, uh, demonstrating how it's being used. Um, I will open my buddy's one. Here. Okay, later on, huh? but this is plastic. Oh, I like it. It's very light. I think that's the most important thing you want to carry light if you are really bringing this elsewhere, right? Okay, I'm going to put this away. I'm going to bring the next item. Okay, as mentioned, this is the other one that... Okay, let's put this away. Yeah, this is the... Um, this is the basis 8 in 1, okay? Basis 8 in 1. So... Well, this has extremely good review, uh, to be honest, even more than the, the plastic one that I bought for myself. Um, that one cost about $16, right, during the fair, uh, during the uh, Shopee sales. This 8-in-1 uh, cost about $41, uh, but with, um, with some Shopee coins. Um, so you do get it at a very good discount because um, you could pay up to, for 8-in-1, you could pay up to 60 plus to $70 on some of the platforms. Okay, I called my buddy earlier on and he has agreed for me to share this uh, unboxing experience of this particular item. Okay, so this is metallic. It has a heft, okay, as compared to this one, as compared to the black one. So let me open this up now. She is very kind, eh? letting me open his stuff. Wow. How about this one more tight than the other one? <laughs> okay, so this is definitely more expensive, okay? Um, it, 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 I, I've seen the review. It's a very good um, product. Okay, for basis items, uh, same thing. Wow, this, this has more stuff inside. Let me see, what is it? Is it the same sticker and things like that? Oh, slightly different, no? Got a, got a love letter inside. Let's see what love letter is it. Nothing. What? Oh, they're really good, right? Uh, this reminds me of how Xiaomi used to pack their items. Ah, this is the stickers again. And this one has a warranty card um, for whatever use, I don't know, because this came directly from China. I guess if you want to, um, you do get 15 days uh, um, uh, return. Shopee allows uh, you to return it because this is under Shopee Mall. So you can just return it and get a refund very easily. Wow, this is good, man. Okay, this is this weighs a more a heavier, and I believe there's an indicator here. I'm not sure about the what's the purpose of this. I mean, if I do discover it, I may highlight it. Okay, so why does my buddy need uh, it in one? He needed one with three USB ports okay as well as hdmi 4k um, but for basis items uh, most of them I, I would say that I've, I've looked through them as far as i know the hdmi is 4k 30 it's not 4k 60 uh, there's something if that's something that uh, you need then um, probably take note of that so the same con uh, configuration for 8 in 1 uh, there are two additional ports one is one more USB 3.0 and the other is a <laughs> LAN, right? This is the LAN port. So for those situations where you don't have any Wi-Fi and you just want to plug in, um, but in current era, very few people want this. But that's the configuration that uh, my friend, my buddy wanted, three ports, okay? Same thing, and it comes protected with a plastic thingy, right? Same thing, you plug it in. Okay, I'm not going to go through this one. I would not recommend this um, 
because there's a huge price difference. Uh, but if you are those that wants to have quality, get this one. Okay, you feel you feel that it's really quality. That means it's something that you you will, you will bring out and you, you think that it's safe. I just scratched the thing. Did you hear that? <laughs> oh no, it's not inside the plaster bag. <laughs> Forgive me, my buddy. It's okay. Uh. I think he will just dump it into his bag like any other things that I saw him with scratches and things like that. Uh, different people take care of things differently. Uh? Mm, okay, not that he's messy. I didn't say that, friend. Okay, I'm going to put this back first. Uh, then I'll go to the last item for today. Okay, the last item for today is optional. Okay, I'm going to bring it closer because it is really small. It is um, from this particular brand known as Fong Ken. Because what happened is that when you want to connect this, you remember this to the MacBook Air, you have to plug in and plug out every time when you bring the MacBook Air out. I'll demonstrate it in a while, but uh, for the time being, um, I'm just going to put this down and I'll bring over my MacBook. Okay, back. Okay, I took out the cover of the MacBook Air. Um, because I don't want to spend time editing out my face from the video. Uh, as mentioned, um, I'm, I'm doing this as a small project, so I, I'm, I'm not trying to be a YouTuber. I'm an aspiring facilitator. I'm trying to use this as a channel as well to, to learn how to edit videos, uh, process things, etc. I still haven't gotten to it yet. Um, so if you have already watched my first video, um, I'm still working on it. So as mentioned earlier on, the MacBook Air M2 has a MagSafe port. And as um, I've also seen it in all the other MacBooks with MagSafe 2, my earlier MacBook Pro, uh, the connectors will, the sides here will start to wear off. And you can see all the silver color below and it becomes very glaring. Uh, so if you have OCD, <laughs> like me, yeah, you, you probably would not be able to accept this um, all the chipping here. Similarly for the USB port, if you miss it, it's gonna get scratched, right? There was a video on uh, by M MKH. He mentioned that it was easy, easy to scratch. I have not scratched it yet because I've, I've got this. So this is a USB magnetic adapter. How does it work? I'll show you later. Oops, what is this? <laughs> hmm, later on, huh? Let's put the MacBook away first, on one side. Okay, comes like this. This cost about, well, it costs more than the cover actually. It costs about 10 plus dollars. No discount whatsoever, no vouchers to be used. And um, you still have to pay for delivery from China. Um, I got it after seeing all the reviews uh, on Shopee. I was looking for one, something like this. Okay, so how it works is that it basically, um, it comes with a USB-C port right here. So you can plug in any USB-C port, including charging uh, wire, PD wire. And here you can see that there's a small light indicator here. So when you plug in, the light will light up, indicating that um, it is in use, yeah. So how is it like? So this is like a coupling thing, right? So if I may use words like this um, seems to be like a female part of the device and this part is a male part. Okay, so how does it actually work? I can show you, I think so. Let's see how it works, yeah. Wow, did you see that? <laughs> okay, so it clips together and So what do you do with this one? So assuming that you only want to bring one set of wire, right? or you don't want to bring your max safe cable out. So all you need to do is to put it, put one of this here. You can choose to put here so you don't obstruct the max safe, but I'm not using the max safe port. I say again, because of the possibility of scratching when you, uh, because it's also as magnetic as this. So it will basically clip and and scratch the pot, maybe. I'm not sure. Uh, it's midnight, uh, and I am really wanting to protect it, so I can't, I can't afford to let it scratch. If I were to return it, I will, I mean, 
yeah, I come to mention of it. Uh, I've been taking so gentle care of this color that I'm a bit frustrated at this point in time. I could go back to the starlight. Wow, earlier pause yeah, already. <laughs> okay, let's put this back. Okay, so now this is the part where we're talking about, right? So the best part about this thing, I think, is that it goes both ways. See that? Right, you can, you can plug it out just like that. Or you can plug it on this end. Doesn't matter. So how does it really work for, for me, as far as I'm concerned, is that I will have several wires connected to here. For example, if my mouse, USB port here, HDMI plug here, my SD card or my um, micro SD card all inserted here and I can plug in my PD wire that means a charging wire here and all I need to do all I need to do is sorry the camera is over here plug it here with my basis right. Right. so with all of this attached and every day, right? If I if I do go, when I do remove my MacBook from the table to bring out, for example, I could just clip here. Look at the color; it's bright already. And here, the light indicator is also out, so it's showing bright. Means that, oh yeah, for those who are not familiar with MacBook, right? Nobody, the MacBook is basically on forever. Nobody actually shut down MacBooks. It's quite unheard of. It's, it's just always powered on. It's just that the Mac OS knows exactly how to balance the um, the usage of the battery. So the battery is extremely good. And, and that's why I got this particular one. So here you go, right? So after when I want to bring my MacBook out, right? So it's very simply, I just unplug. And then I can just bring out like this. With this on. It doesn't matter. I think it's a small little protrusion from the MacBook, but it's very handy. So when you're back again, before you open up your MacBook, all you need to do is just pull this. Sorry about the sound. Just put it back again and then just clip on and everything starts again. Yeah, see? And um, okay, after looking at it for very some time, I still do not know how to connect this. Maybe some of you who knows how to can teach me how to do it. No slots, no holes whatsoever to put this. I guess it's um, it's probably um, the box used as a container for another purpose. Probably it's a mistake altogether. Okay, that's it for today. The three items. May, uh, let me summarize again. The cover, right? The plastic cover. Nice. That's, uh, that cost $10. About sixteen dollars during fair. You can wait for ten ten or eleven eleven, uh, which will give you quite a lot of um, discounts. Those who want to have a better quality, you can go for the metallic ones. They also come in six in one, if I'm not wrong. But the price is definitely more expensive. It's probably about thirty plus. And lastly, I highly recommend this for people who are using modern notebooks. Uh, without the HDMI ports um, and just have USB-C ports. This is very convenient. One solution for everything. When you connect, everything lights up. Your, your mouse, your monitor, yeah, what have you. There could be other brands available in the market. So please look out for them and read the reviews carefully. And if you are like me, um, like on a budget, right? Budget as well as um, trying to make the dollar work harder for us, buy the cheapest things, uh, do consider to buy online and to be really sure, try to stick to a particular platform that gives you um, rebates, uh, discounts, and on those uh, sales day, uh, days of sales, right, you'll get good discounts for the items. So these are the four things that I've shown you today. Um, if there are more uh, items that um, I, I use along the way, I'll probably put it into a next video for you guys. So thank you for watching. I hope everybody is uh, staying safe. I'll be heading out to Sabah tomorrow night. Okay, I'll see if I can do one Sabah video as well. I'll try to do it. Okay, take care guys. Bye-bye. Hi, I decided to demo this. So if you remembered, I mentioned about this 
the HDMI port being attached here. So when I come back, right, I do not have to keep plugging in and out of the ports here, uh, which may damage the, the USB-C port. So instead, all I do is that just clip back in. Do you hear the sound? My mouse lights up here. And um, monitor should light up. Yep, my monitor is up as well. See that? So you have all the peripherals attached there. Just just about to go for, say you want to go out to the coffee shop. Or, yeah. So all you need to do is just unplug, close it. Good to go. Okay.